Hello everybody and welcome to my video. Today I'm here to show you this wonderful moth that just hatched from its cocoon after almost half a year of waiting. It's a moth from Kenya and I believe it's Apifora plutsi or at least a species that is strongly related to Apifora plutsi. As you can see it's a rather big moth. As it may be very clear to, uh, to most people, Epiphora species are uh, related to Atacus, to Hyalophora, to Samia moth, the kind of species that we all know very well. And this one is no exception, although there are a lot of species of them, and not a lot is known about them, and I really hope I have success with breeding them. Last year I had a pairing of this species, but I failed to raise the caterpillars, which is a shame because it would be a, f a first time a first uh, time opportunity to see the life cycle. But I guess you can't have everything now, can you? Just look at how incredible it is. Whenever a moth like this hatches from its own cocoon, it just makes my whole day. I've been pretty euphoric. What would be even better is if a female would hatch for him to pair with and to give me a second chance at breeding this species. Just check out those details. Scales. What a beautiful little thing. Even its abdomen is beautiful. It's golden. Wow. What an awesome species. Oops. Thank you for watching, everybody. And stay tuned because I have a lot more species coming up this year, including some pretty unique ones. That I'm pretty sure nobody else has filmed yet, or maybe even photographed. Thanks and goodbye.